Hold on, I think I know the question here. You want to know about my military background, don't you? Well, the truth is I went to war, but I forgot the bullets, so I came back. How was the war? We lost it. Oh no! Yep, woke up one morning and it had gone. Completely vanished. You should have chained it to a bloody fence. Look, I forgot to, okay? Well, you're back in time for Greg's birthday. What have you got me? Many happy returns. How many? What about sad returns? Or tax returns? They're all inclusive. It's a variety pack of returns. Oh, thanks a lot. Oh, I wish me mum were here to see this. You mean PJC Construction Limited? Yeah. Mum! You made it! I'm not your mum, pal. I just sealed your windows. Ah. Right, birthday inspection. Show us your guts. There's nothing dodgy going on inside me. Well, whip off your wall so we can all see. Yep, this all looks in order. Hold on a minute. Contents Insurance Company, 35% cheaper than local rival. Oh, seven, nine, eight, two, thirty-five, thirty-five, thirty-two. Will that do, yeah? Is that egg still running? <laughs> I feel sick. Make it stop. I need to pass my boss. I'm going to die. Oh, look, they're filming a TV show. Tap Scar! The programme that finds stuff and shows it to you. We're deep within the bowels of this birthday building today, scouring around for any old tat. Here's a soggy chessboard with all the pieces missing. That's fantastic! Clip it over, Nine Man's Morris. Essentially, it's two games in one. Don't forget drafts! Well, shake that tat stick, we've got a hat trick, earning this a spot in today's tat satchel. Ooh. When did you realise that your flat was an untapped tat gold mine? I think it was when I bought it. Next week, we'll be smacking more elderly bums for tat treasure or just for pleasure. See you then. Well, there's your inspection. What's the summary, knackered Jack? Mm, it has the potential to be a three-star accommodation, but I am slightly concerned about the rising damp. I give it three partially smoked cigarettes out of a crammed ashtray. So, is that a good enough answer for you? Aye, that's cleared everything up. Thank you for the learnings. Hey man, quick question. Do the buildings still argue? No, we get on famously. Some of us are lovers. Excuse me, I was asked the question and I have a story to attach. It'll be a longer day than usual, but also a shorter week. See you there. Thanks, Paul. The local yeah. headlines. Yeah, uh-huh. Right. The tallest building decided the city was a dirty mess and it was all my fault. And I'm blind up here, vacuumed down these stinky clouds. I was first instructed to remove the city's most embarrassing building. I remember what you said. <laughs> oh, oh, is that a black apple for me? Yes, it is. Also true. A special treat. A special you. Oh, what a rush of joy. May I name her before I taste? Go on then, if you must. Tracy. <laughs> I was also asked to make a documentary film. <laughs> I want it on you! Oh, made that referendum to stop me job to go to Chippy. Get our slap or stay off and I'll No, you. no, what, there's something wrong with your voice. Speak clearly. Um. Um. Well, come on then, do something. What well, I'm thinking, all right? Uh, have you got anything, Clive? Come on, this is supposed to be realistic, okay? So start acting interesting. You'll have to film us for weeks to get out good. Well, I've only got one tape, and it's half filled with snooker bloopers. Don't tape over the... Easy red to left middle there, leaving a small gap for the black. 29. You shit! <laughs> Look at this babby with chocolate on face. Put it away, you granddad. You pissing filming my cat for. I tell you, get back here now. Excuse me, could I interview you for my documentary? Will it be like the Japanese documentary about the bastard owl? 
Um, no, I don't think so, no. Well, I'm just not interested then, I'm sorry. I was instructed to edit down and dub the footage to try and reach a more mainstream audience. I love you, Clive. He's asking for a smack. Don't you touch her again, all right? <laughs> I just want to watch X Factor. Turn this off. I want attractive people to like or ugly losers to hate. These buildings are in between. Turn it off. And so my documentary failed to get this city back on the map, and now we're completely lost. Well, you know, I didn't really follow that man, but I guess it had enough colour to hold my attention, so <laughs> thank you. I'm writing a book and I just need to know, do these buildings still argue? Who sent you? What have you heard? I just heard a whisper on the breeze. Well, you shouldn't pay attention to that breeze. She's a renowned fabricator. Golf isn't a sport. Did you hear that? Hear what? Golf isn't a sport. What's golf? Is it like half? You know, like when you half someone. There is no E in team. Why, who says there is? Who says what? I know what you're up to. Breeze. And I don't like it. I'm not the breeze. I'm a sneeze. These buildings are getting thicker by the day. Nonsense! My buildings are the sharpest of the sharp. You there, give me the lowdown. Throw me the facts. Which ones? Just the basics. Summarise the way things are. Well, buildings eat trees, trees eat bees, and bees eat sneezes. That is the circle of life. Not all buildings eat trees. We, for example, are metaltarians. Trees is murder! We eat vans and lorries. Vans is murder! We eat the French. I propose, to decrease the dimness around here, we screen some informative videos. Hello, I'm Taylor, and today I'm going to show you how to look from side to side. Hey, I can see loads more now. What are you looking at? You might want to breathe through your nose instead of your mouth. And you can buy washing powder, and you can buy chocolates, and you can buy batteries, and you can buy... Oh, it started to black me out a bit, this. I'm going to show you guys how to change the channel. Can you do that? Breeze. Hey, it's Breeze. The breeze will please your knees. Allow me to adjust your misinformation. How are gravy granules made? I will show you. Where do expensive luxury cats come from? Hey! 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 And so my buildings are now officially the world's most misled structures, according to this magazine. I'm not too sure about all that, to be honest, but I'm sure you gave it your best. Welcome back to Night Mind, friends. I do hope you've been adjusting well to the colder weather. It's precisely this time of year that I remember a lot of captivating online horror moments have unfolded, and I feel that in a section of the forest that was considered dead. In one of those sections, there's a forest entrance, and inside, he found a statuette. This statuette, to be precise, seen in the extra image he provided through a link in the description. Beneath it was a patch of recently disturbed earth, with a small red string sticking out. 